What's up guys, it's Teabag back again, and I know it's been a very long time since I've had a video out, but don't fear, for I am back and I am going to be making more videos. So today I have some Trials of Osiris gameplay, but before I get to that real quick, I just want to say real quick, um, I got over a thousand views on my last video with my Doctrine of Passing, and that is insane. Like, absolutely insane. I can't believe I got that many views on that video. And I didn't, I didn't like, share any links. I didn't promote it. Like, that was all people who shared it that they thought the, the gameplay was good. So if you watched that video and you shared it, I really appreciate that. Thank you so much because I never would have thought, and like, none of my videos have more than, like, 200 views, I don't think. And to get a 1,000 on that, like, out of nowhere... That's just mind-blowing to me, so thank you so much for that. Um, but anyway, let's go ahead and get into this gameplay. This was from this last weekend, and I didn't get like a crazy amount of kills in this game. I didn't, you know, like make some crazy, insane like clutches or anything like that, but I did make some nice plays, and I just wanted, I really liked the symmetry that our team had, where we played together, and um, anyway. So I'm using Doctor of Passing in a Sniper, and I'm on my Titan. So I just want to sit close quarters, so I always go inside here, and uh, right there, <clears throat> my teammate, he got a body shot on him, so I threw a grenade, and they were both over there, was able to kill both of them with my lightning grenade. I really love Striker on this map, I felt like it was perfect for all the close quarter engagements, and all the little alleys and nooks and crannies people can sit in, lightning grenades just worked really well. <laughs> So here, I'm just sort of <laughs> standing the hags. Both my teammates almost died to try mine there. Um, and uh, I was able to get the kill, luckily. He didn't have, like, a insane range conspiracy theory there. I probably would have died, but... Uh, yeah, so I start off 3-0. That's not bad. Um, <laughs> I mean, I guess that's about as good as you can start off. But anyway, I'm going to go back inside every round. Um, it worked out well because I, I want to stick to close range with this Doctrine of Passing. I don't want to get outside of its range. <clears throat> so I see they're over there again, so I throw another grenade, and my teammate actually snipes both these guys, so uh, GG to him, he's actually, uh, he's a really solid player, uh, shout out to him, <laughs> right there, uh, my, my teammate is actually, he's, uh, he's texting somebody back at that moment, so the shotgunner, he saw the opportunity and he took it, <laughs> so I was able to get the kill on him, and uh, it was just a little funny moment we had between us. We were all laughing at him for just sitting there, but <clears throat> anyway, uh, we're, so we're up 2-0, and uh, every time, you know, it's just, it just seems repetitive, but it works, so uh, here, actually, we got in a bad position. They threw a bunch of grenades, and I just stood there, which was extremely dumb on my part. I should have gotten out of there as soon as I saw both those grenades were thrown, but uh, yeah, I stuck in there, and uh, that's what I get for it. I got a death. So, at this point, both of us got picked off, and uh, we just left him. He was still texting somebody back, so <laughs> he had to, like, come out of that and try to clutch the 1v3. So, yeah, that we didn't set him up for success there. But uh, <laughs> that's, I think, the only really hiccup we had. Uh, moving on to the next round here. Uh, and I'm still going to go inside here, and... Uh, Instead of challenging the top, I'm going to peek out to the right, and I hit a really nice snipe right here. I see they're rushing out here, I just zoom in, bang, and I hit him, and I double melee that guy. He had no idea where I was, uh, and then I'm able to clean up that last guy after he had some damage on him. And, uh, man, <laughs> uh, it was a pretty nice snipe, I was happy with it, and, uh, yeah, so, you know, our team's rolling. Um, we're, doing, we're doing pretty well. And um, we're going to go ahead and heavy. I always go inside on heavy on this map. I was going to Titan Smash if I needed to, but it uh, turns out they didn't They didn't challenge. Mer <clears throat> my teammate there, he just ran up on him, got, got the kill with the last word. And um, yeah, so I, I never challenge that middle lane. It just seems like a death trap. You really can't get out of there, so. Uh, both my both my teammates actually aren't getting the kills here, so um, I really don't have to do anything. I I didn't do anything this round except for I stayed alive. I actually got lucky there. Um, 
there's been a lot of people that have died from just jumping up in the air and landing on the map, so luckily that didn't happen to me there. I would have been pretty upset, but uh, yeah. So here, we're up 4-1, to just trying to close it out. Uh, yeah, my teammate gets a pick here early, and uh, I'm, I'm able to uh, and come in and get the last two kills. <clears throat> he, he lightning grenades me and primes me, and he actually almost kills me in my animation there. And that happened to me a lot this weekend, it seemed like. And, um, yeah, it's just, I don't know. I don't know if I'm, like, just barely pressing the button and it's starting, so it's not counting as the unstoppable or what, but it just seemed like I got killed quite a bit of times, like, in my Fist of Havoc animation this weekend. But, anyway, I was able to get the nice snipe there at the end and I finished out the game. And I hope you guys enjoyed the gameplay. Uh, I hope you guys sort of uh, understood my... My reasoning, my thought process, that's always my aim when I make these videos, is for you to understand what's going on in my mind when I make the decisions that I make. And uh, Anyway, if you liked the video, please click the like button and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in another video. Thank you.